channel budget for success you know I promised in my previous video that I would tell you what I spelled out for f-o-u-r budget for success for me the cash stuffing and the savings and all the concepts that I've learned by so many people in the cash stuffing community and the budgeting community that I developed this acronym for. And F stands for family, which is why I'm doing all this, is for my family. O is for opportunities. I wanna look for opportunities to save, opportunities to invest, and opportunities to retire debt, which is why you know we do what we do, right? And then U is for unity with my husband. And let me tell you, he totally supports me in this cash stuffing because he has seen how much money we have saved and how much money I have not spent. That he's like, whatever I need, he's like, what you need? I, you need a camera set up? I'll set your camera up. Like, he's totally on board. So it's really created more unity. And then R, which for me personally is the biggest reason, is for retirement. It's time, y'all. I'm getting to that space where I need to look at retirement. So I want to retire and be financially um, secure. I also want to retire and know how to manage my funds and not waste my money. So that is why I have budget for success. All right, let's get started. It's savings challenge. We're in the month of August and we're about to save some money. So let's see how much we're saving today. So 20s, we have two, four, six, eight. So we got $80 in 20s. 10s, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So that's $90 in 10s. 5s, we got 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, Quite a few twos. My bank teller had two. So two, four, six, eight, ten. So ten dollars in twos. And how many ones? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Equals two hundred and seventy-four dollars. So that's how much we had to work with today for our savings challenge. All right, you know, this is my favorite part of cash stuffing is the savings challenge. So the first all-time favorite right now is Shut the Box. I got this from Reinventing Renee or Budget Nerd Company. This is called Shut the Box. And Shut the Box and I, we have this love-hate relationship going on because I can't seem to shut the box. And in the meantime, I've been saving a whole lot of money. <laughs> Let's see what we got today. What can we do today? Let's see if I can shut the box on camera. That would be nice. All right. That's a seven. I'm going to just mark off seven. I've tried different strategies. Now that's 11. Let's get this nine out and a two out. I really have. And none of them seem to work. We got nine. So let's do eight and one. Maybe this is it, y'all. I'm feeling it. What do you think? Oh, shucky ducky. Six and two is eight. All right, wait, I can do five and three. Okay, come on, y'all. We can do this. Ten. Come on. Blue on the dice. Ten. Ten. Dang it. I got seven. I can't do anything with it. So I'm saving ten instead of getting a ten. Uh, all right, so let's say Let's ten dollars. All right, that's okay. Let's do it again. I was a warm-up. I was getting warm. Okay, three. Let's cross three off. Choop, choop. We got nine. I'm going to get rid of that big nine. Eight. How about I get rid of the big eight? At least keeps me out, out the bank. Oh, we got 12. Let's do seven and five. Okay. Okay. We're getting rid of the big stuff now. We can work with this. Nine. Oh, dang. Six, four. No, no nine. I'm going to do six, two, and one make up my own rules reinventing Renee said you can make up your own rules okay so that's 10 13 13 all right so we're at 23 dollars all right let's see now we're getting that we get to the high numbers now we get to the high numbers shut the box what you doing 
Come on. Three and one is four. Here we go. Finally crossed off that four. Six and four is ten. I'm going to do the nine and one. Three. No. Three. I can't do three. All right, done. We are done. That was quick. We only made it through three rows. Okay, what do we have? We got 13, 18. What's that? 20? <laughs> What's this? That's $43. Isn't that what I got before? $43. I had to save $43. Man, oh man. Okay, let's let's put the 10 back and let's just get $43. Oh my goodness. Well, you must know that I am saving a lot of money and shut the box. This is my shut the box envelope. Look at this. Look, I am saving a lot of money with shut the box. Shut the box is really doing what it's supposed to do because I cannot win. I cannot win. Okay, guys, we'll have to come back next payday, next savings challenge and see if I can shut the box, but it will not be today for sure. We have not shut the box today. All right, let's go. Let's move on to some other fun savings challenge because shut the box was not kind to me. So our next savings challenge, oh, I always bring this out just to remind you guys that I'm really am trying to get to France, but I have, there's some large numbers here. So I need to keep saving and then I'm gonna pull money from those other savings to get here. But it's there because I want to go to France. I want to take my son to France. I promised him. You know, a promise is a promise. Okay, but now let's do savings challenge number two because this is something that I can uh, I can get behind right now today. So savings challenge number two is this cute mermaid. And I got to roll the dice. Okay, so I, I'm rolling the dice to see what mermaid... So this mermaid tail is gonna be worth $8. So let's put an eight here. Okay, let's see. Let's do more. Let's, I'll spin again. And seven. That's good. <laughs> Cause I put, put most of the money with the, shut the box. So eight and seven is 15. And I'll color this in later. So there is I'll even fill in. Is it the tracker cute? Okay, so the tracker is from Counting My Pennies. It's a mermaid tail. It's cute, so I'm going to add this. I'll add it in later. Okay, but we adding $15 to this savings challenge. Okay, so we're getting there. This is a good one. I just roll the dice and see what I get. And it's kinder to me than the shut the box. So we're going to gradually get where we need to be with this challenge. Okay, I got all this stuff here. All right, we'll get that later. So that's done. Okay, now savings challenge number three. That's this one is reach for the stars. This is the Christmas tree. And I feel like I'm making traction on this Christmas tree. But today, the box got us today. So we're just gonna do $5. So I'll color this star in and I'll add $5, but we're we're doing good. We even got a $100 bill in here. So this is for date night for my husband and I. Okay, and then somebody asked me, um, what am I gonna do with some of these savings challenges? Cause you know, you're just adding all this money up. Well, I decided I'm gonna do left, right, center to figure out what I'm gonna do with my savings challenge. So I'm gonna play this game. So when I finish the savings challenge, I'll play left, right, center, and I'll probably do it so you guys can see it. Okay, savings challenge number four is for me to get a bike, and I'll color in a heart. So we'll do a red heart, and I want to get an electric bike, though, not just a regular bike, an electric bike. So each heart is worth $10. Um, so we're working on this, but there's my $10. So we're going to add that to the pot. We're getting there. We got a lot of hearts to go, but that's okay. Just keep moving. So my job, if you ride your bike or, you know, find different ways to get to work instead of driving, my job will give you money. So there's an incentive that I get this bike. 
so I can ride. I try, I tried biking to work with my regular pedal bike. Oh my God, I was so sweaty. I couldn't even work through the day. I was so sweaty. It was, no, I couldn't do it. I tried. Okay, so this is a ladybug challenge and these are $2. I think it goes up to $20. And so let's see, let's scratch off, you know. Um, okay, this isn't working. I don't know why I pulled that out. Let's get a quarter. Why well, I had a change sitting here so you can scratch it off. All right, this is only $2. Okay, $2. All right, should we try one more? I'll try one more. Um, I'm left to right kind of person. Oh, there I go. <laughs> I should have stayed at $2. All right, I'm at $18. We're going to stop now. All right, $18. Here are my envelopes. So that's 18 and 2 is 20. So here we put a 20 in. All right, so we are done with this. And here, look at this cute tracker. And this is from Snow Stamper Budgeting. Snow Stamper Budgeting. She gave me these trackers. Well, she didn't give them to me. I paid for them. <laughs> Off Etsy. Etsy. I am supporting the Etsy community. Yes, I am because this stuff is so cute. Okay, my next savings challenge, number seven. This is for vacation. And I'm just scratching them off. So, again, like I said, I'm going to go left to right. So, this is $5. So, this will be a $5 one. So there's 10. I scratched off all the big numbers. You see, I scratched off 35, 45, 40, 30. I got all the big ones. So there's 10. Let me see. What, how much is left? I got, I think there's not that many big numbers, right? So one, so 10, 12, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. 20 so this is 210 and this is a 225 dollar so so 10 let's do it let's scratch this off so we can finish it and i can play left right center left right center that's a game i got from reinventing renee on her budget channel reinventing renee has left right center she got instructions on there how to play so we about to do that so here's five dollars and then what else? And then fifteen dollars. We are we are at two hundred and twenty-five dollars. Woo! I am done with my fun. So fifteen dollars. So now we got two twenty-five. Yes. We can call this complete. 10, 12, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, half 22 half 23 what that didn't go right try it again 10 12 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 half 22 half 23 so did i put too much in oh well i'm at 230 dollars so i want five dollars over okay that's good i'll take it so this now will go to vacation all right that's done and this is another cute tracker sheet. So I'll add that to this with the ladybugs. All right, now savings challenge number eight. I've got three ladybugs colored in. So let's see, how much do I wanna put on this one? Um, let's do $15 is my vision. So I need a black marker. So $15, what can I do with 15? I can do six, so that's a four and a two makes six. And then another four is 10. And then a five, so I only have half a ladybug left. And then I'm gonna finish this challenge. So that's 15. Let's see if I have money left over at the end. I probably won't, but we can try. So we'll add 15 to this. And then we'll finish this one. This will be 150. And we'll play left, right, center and see where this money goes. Okay? Alrighty. Now this one is a roll the dice. Okay, so this one, you roll the dice. If it's an even number, you multiply it by two. If it's an odd number, just add $2. So it's 10. So it's an even number. So we're going to add 20 to this one. So there we go. There's 20. 
we're gonna put $20, $20, this one's actually adding up pretty quick. So $20. All right. Ladybugs. And I have another cute ladybug tracker. There's another ladybug tracker. Okay, Care Bears. All right, I'm going to tell you now, we can't we can't mess with the Care Bears. So we're going to we're going to do the $50 Care Bear. We're not messing with Care Bear today. I'm going to do the other hand. So the one hand was 8 and then this hand is 10. Okay, we're going to do 10 and that's it. We stopping. <laughs> There's some big dollars on some of these other Care Bears. We're going to stay with this one. So that's $10. All right. We got $10. So we're going to put $10 in here. This is planned with Lila Blue. She made up these cute Care Bear challenges. But we're good. We stopped right there. Stop right there. All right. Now this is a new one that I came up with. Or I didn't come up with it. I mean, I got it from Donna Powered by Creativity. But it replaced um, another challenge that I finished. And so, let's see. This is... We're going to see what we're going to do here. Let's scratch it off and see how much we come up with. Let's do... Let's go down. I'm going to go down. All right. Five dollars. I think what I do is do five and then like I did here, I'll color in um, a flower. So a flower is four, five, six, nine. So nine dollars, nine dollars for a flower. Let's just, you know, I'll draw it in here. I'll color it later. So nine and five is 14. So 14, oh, all that 15. Cause I'm a big spender. Okay, so I've added $15 to this. Aww. Monsters Eat. Okay, moving on to the next savings challenge, which is the Ladybug Savings Challenge, where this is from the Happy Mailbox Company, because I am loving that envelope. And so we're going to do, let's see, $20. So... $20, I can do either two spots or... Let's do, let's do, let's do like the, the head, right? Should be 20, but this should be black and the shell. Okay, so we did the head. Whoopsie. All right, so let's add $20. 20, we'll do 10 and two fives. Cause I get rid of my fives. Okay, there we go. There's $20 to the Ladybug Savings Challenge. We'll color it in later and then we got the mermaids these are just the cutest in my opinion these mermaids are too cute okay so on the mermaids let's see there's one for 20 if i'm going straight across and then a 10 so that would be 30 dollars. so a 10 for this mermaid and then a 20 for this mermaid and we, if we do it this way, we'll finish at the same time. But one is for 120 and one is for 150. So 10 for this one. And then it was 20 for this one, right? 5, 10, 15, 20. So that's a total of $30. And again, you guys on Etsy had the cutest things. So I was able to make this envelope from the download on Etsy. And this mermaid challenge is from the Happy Mailbox. It was an easy download. I printed it on the rainbow paper and laminated it. So you can get creative if you like it. Okay. Now, let's see. We got money left to do my favorite. This is... From Busy Lizzie's Budget. Y'all know this is my favorite because it's the 80s, y'all. So we're going to do Garfield. $2 for Garfield. 
Okay, we're going to get through all of it first and then come back. So I'll put $2 in here for Garfield. Alf, we roll the dice. And we put $4 for Alf. So we'll put $4. I think I rolled a different dice. I got 12 there. That's okay. Urkel, did I do that? So this is $5. So we'll put $5 in. And then I said the mushrooms were worth five. So I'm gonna put $5 in here, color it in. So there's five. Who you gonna call? Ghostbusters! So there's another two dollars. And I still have a two dollar bill over there, so we're gonna save that. Two dollars, two dollars. Flintstones, meet the Flintstones. And I don't know anything else on that song. <laughs> I used to listen to it as a kid. You'll have a yabba dabba do time. I'll have a gee old time. I think it goes different, but whatever. I'm going to do one more on Fred. Let's do two for Fred. Eight dollars. <laughs> ah, that's funny. I used to know all those songs from the TV shows because they play them all the time. Five, six, seven, eight. So that's eight dollars. And then Elroy is ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's see, that is right. No, probably one more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh Lord, this is stressful. Okay, I'm gonna I'm color this in. We're giving ten dollars to Elroy. I think that's Elroy. Isn't that the name of the dog, Elroy? Okay, now I gotta scratch off. Tom and Jerry, and I have five dollars left. So let's just hope we get whatever it is. If it's less than five, I put the whole five dollars in, so I'm gonna have more than sixty dollars. All right. If not, if it's more than five dollars, I have an IOU coming. Oh, it's one dollar. Uh oh. Do I take a chance and scratch off another one, or just no? I'm gonna just stay right where I am. I don't like owing oh, my savings challenge. I'm just putting in five dollars. I have four dollars extra in this savings challenge because you know I'm a big baller. <laughs> I got four dollars extra. All right, that was fun. I honestly love these savings challenges. It is really a fun way to save money, and you know what? Whatever it takes, whatever works for you. If the savings challenge don't work for you, and you like to just put your money in the bank, then do that. But whatever you do, do it because you're having fun and it's enjoyable because that's makes you want to do more. It makes you, makes you want to save more. It makes you want to have more fun. So please join me next time so you can see me shut this box because I am going to do it on camera. I'm going to shut the box. It's coming. Bye. All right. That's it. We finished. We're complete. Thank you. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Budget for success. Bye for now.